So the suggestion that I had was um, for him to write to his mother, I love you, mom. <laughs> Seems like a bit of a generic have, have message. And then to make it less generic, for, for his dad, I suggested that he write a matching one. But instead of saying I love you, it says, love you too, I guess. <laughs> John. <laughs> and then that would make uh, both of them less generic because they're matching. They come as a pair. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and then I thought it'd be a little bit funny too. Uh, but what are some other ideas? Mm. I don't know. Let's see. It's kind of hard to think of a heartfelt message mm -hmm. in the space of three or four or five words. Uh, does that mean you never think of your parents and what you want to say to your parents? Uh, I talk to them often enough. Uh -huh. But I uh, usually express that anyways. Oh, okay. What do you usually just, what do you usually tell them? Oh, usually <laughs> talk about talk about our days. Mm -hmm. Talk about what's going on that week. Usually discuss uh, what we had for lunch. Always with my mom, we discuss what we had for lunch or go, mm -hmm. or going to eat later in the day. My mom always likes to go on about either what she's going to cook or what she's eaten. And then we end up talking a little bit too much. Sometimes we talk about a recipe. Uh -huh. And then she'll go on about how I do the recipe, uh -huh. um, and then maybe I'll get to a bit of a extended, lengthy conversation. But that's not something that can be expressed on a maybe maybe you have, like maybe you have like an inside joke. Mm. Something like that. Uh, do you want to practice on here? Oh, sure. You did it! Oh, so where, where do you end up getting your leather these days? Internets. Part of it is kind of sitting along the keychain. Fly. No, I'm not the edges. So what kind of tool is this? This is called an edge beveler. Because I want it to be visible when it's on the keychain. Mm -hmm. So at the very least at the start, I can probably put my name down here. Mm -hmm. So maybe I'll practice one more time. You're an artist. <laughs> that feels right. You got it. Yeah, hold it. You have to give it a big hard, hard bump, right? There you go. Because this is very clearly a heart, but the heart mm -hmm. is a very specific shape. Yeah, the whereas, guitar whereas pick it, is also can also be a distinct shape. That's the best example. There we go. Um, what's it called? It's called Pacific. Mm -hmm. It's called Pacific Euro. Just 